Horses on the track for the fourth race, first of two divisions in round two of the Matt Scooter Pacing Series. Number one is Joe Paz Benchmark, owned by William Solomon in the Impazamato Stables with Luke Wallet. Number two, Double Down Hanover, owned by Angelo Frazetto and Michael Zaffirano with Jim Morrill Jr. Number three, Upfront Northern, Danielle Dubay driving for Mark Krause. Number four is Best Always, owned by the Seagulls Racing Stables and Herb Siegel with Dave Miller. Number five is Mount Killa Pangero, owned by the Peter Pan Stables, George Brennan. Number six, Vandal Hanover, owned by Brian Pinsky Stables and Jim Simpson with Eric Ledford. Number seven is Signatory, John Campbell driving for owner Ron Mario. Number eight, Forever Raptor, all by Jerry Migel, Mike Lachance. Number nine, Scratched Sick. And number ten is Cheyenne Ray. Under lease to the Cheyenne gang, Cat Manzi is in the sulky. It's post time for the first of two divisions in round two of the Mant Scooter Pacing Series tonight for the three-year-old Pacers. They're all in behind the gate, and here they come. And they're off Forever Raptor and Signatory from the outside. Off stride, Joe Paz Benchmark. Number one, Joe Paz Benchmark has gone on a break. From the inside, Double Down Hanover has come out racing in third. Up front, Northern follows him fourth, taking a top fifth as best always. Sixth on the inside as they pace around the opening turn is Mount Kilopangero, and he's followed up seventh by Vandal Hanover. Cheyenne Ray backed off the gate, reserved early, and Joe Paz Benchmark struggling at the back, and Forever Raptor strung out to make the lead, the quarter and 28 seconds flat. Sinatore now releases him for the pocket and second, and Double Down Hanover is two and a half lengths further back third. A gap of three to up front, Northern and fourth. Best always looks to be bearing out a bit in fifth, and racing six behind him, Mount Kilopangero. Vandal Hanover is showing the whip from seventh, edging to the outside. Cheyenne Ray will probably follow him, and at the tail of the field, Joe Paz Benchmark is far behind trailing as they head toward the half-mile marker. Forever Raptor controlling the tempo here. The half and 57 and four, a 29 and four second quarter breather. Racing in second is Sinatory, content to follow in the pocket. Double down Hanover third. Up front, Northern has been flushed to the outside. Best always hopes to use his cover. Stacked up third over now is Vandal Hanover with excess cover. Mount Kilopangero is trapped in Cheyenne Ray back to the inside. And out of the pocket, here comes Sinatory to take a run at Forever Raptor as they pace around the far turn, reaching the three-quarter marker, 127-2. and two. A comfortable middle half here for Forever Raptor. Looks to sprint away at the top of the stretch and he's rebuffed the charge from Sinatory so far it's Forever Raptor two lengths in front and eighth to come up on the outside Sinatory coming at him again best always on the outside Cheyenne Ray despite traffic trouble has moved into third but it is Forever Raptor who's going to take this field coast to coast Forever Raptor wins it second with Sinatory third Cheyenne Ray and fourth best always 154 and three Returning to the winner's circle again, number eight, Forever Raptor. Ohio-bred three-year-old by Stan Forever, out of Audubon Elmerhurst by Sun Sam, all by Jerry Migel of Westland, Michigan, Mark Jordan, the trainer, and Mike Lachance is in the sulky. Two in a row at the Big M for Forever Raptor, who scores here in 154 and three. He's now two for two in Matt Scooter series action. Results posted official. In the winner's circle from the Hoboken Brownstone Company, We'd like to welcome Danny Gans and George Vallone making the trophy presentation to winning driver Mike Lachance and Forever Raptor. Number eight, Forever Raptor, both a Holly Hotshot and a Ken Warkington selection, $4 even, $3.20 and $2.40. Second, number seven, Signatory, $6.80, $4.20. And third, number 10, Cheyenne Ray, $3.40. Exacta 8.7 pays 